Hey everyone, Ash here, and Multi Awesome will be joining me for this mission. I asked, he asked about it, uh, uh, I think he asked about it after a, uh, I can't remember when he asked about it, but, but yeah, he asked if he could join a couple of my missions. I think somebody else asked about that too. I can't remember, but if so, you'd probably want to, uh, probably want to talk talk to me about it because yeah I can't remember I know a couple of people asked but at this point I can't really remember captain I have been authorized by the ruling council my world to seek to seek Starfleet assistance we have declared our independence from the Romulan Star Empire and requested aid and recognition from the Federation Council we are willing to defend ourselves but it will take some time to activate our force our forces our sensors have detected Romulan ships in the system. They're probably here to, te to test our defenses in preparation for an invasion. If you could assist with our defense by patrolling the system and defeating the Romulan scout patrols, we will have the time we would need to launch our fleet. Alright, so basically we need to destroy some Romulan ships. And if I'm not mistaken, I think now that the dialogue box is closed, Yep, sure enough, he was able to enter. So, let's head on and let's blow up some Romulan ships. Let me turn down the sound because that's kind of loud. Hit all the, uh, hit all the things here. Yeah, not too surprising. A lot of this, a lot of the ships are now turning their attention to him because I think, I think he's the bigger threat. He's matching my level. I think. Oh no, mind. I was about to say I think he, I think he was matching my level, but no, they turned their attention back to me now. If he was playing, if a uh, he was playing at his regular regular level, he'd be able to completely uh, massacre these enemies. It's kind of like the way that one guy was uh, playing at a way much lower level than uh, I was, and the uh, Romulans were just the Romulans were just completely obliterating him. I'm still not exactly sure how he got into my. Uh, how he got into my deal when he was 26 levels below me, below my, uh, below my uh, ship, but oh well. We have two birds of prey and one of those escorts. And the escort just dropped uh, those annoying poking mines. Apparently... Huh. He called it, somehow he called in a, uh, called in other ships. I'm not sure how he was able to do that. Oh well, doesn't matter. The more help, the, the more help we have, the better. That must be a, uh, I don't think those, no, those are definitely holographic ships. Okay. I had to get a good look at them, but they warped in instead. Usually when you, Usually, when you bring holographic ships in, they don't they don't have the warp in the, the warp in effect. They uh, they just kind of appear, but those warped in. Fly around all these all, all these uh, asteroids here, and here we have birds of prey and an escort. Well, we know what we do with those. He's got a. Uh, I'm not sure what kind of ship he's flying. All I know is it has some serious upgrades to it. I think he has a lot of the board stuff from the, uh, from the, uh, what is that thing called? The STFs. I, if, uh, 
whenever I reach that level, I will definitely be showing off the STFs, but all I can say is that it's not going to be pretty. Oh, there goes my light shield, somewhat. And he's just sending in a fleet of torpedoes. Take these items. Uh, what do we have? Uh, I got a weapons battery, and I think the last one I got was an engine battery. Evasive maneuvers. I think he might have an Aegeus. I'm not sure, but I think, judging by that deal, he might have an Aegeus, an Aegeus uh, shield array. And we have two escorts here. Oh well, these blow up just like any other Romulan ship, so let's have at them. Somehow, somehow he lasted a little bit. Uh, I'm out of uh, range of that escort. And now I'm back in range. But yeah, somehow I uh, somehow that escort was surviving at zero hull integrity. I think I think it used hacks. Oh great, cloaking mines. That takes care of him. And hopefully I can avoid the mines once we look for our final batch of enemies. No, unfortunately, uh, unfortunately my ship triggered a couple of the mines, but it also took care of those mines. And yeah, it takes a takes a while for the uh, full impulse to activate when you uh, when you get a tap there what do we have here it's probably going to be a Romulan warbird yep sure enough Romulan warbird not just one Romulan warbird either Alright, but he's having problems there. His, uh, I noticed his shields were a little bit damaged. Uh, well, of course, my ship, I'm not sure, other than actually manually, manually, manually selecting a ship, I'm not sure how the game decides when to, uh, when to a, uh, I have absolutely no idea what I'm saying. I'm, I have no idea when the game actually decides how, uh, how it, how it selects who to, uh, have your shield uh, or buffs and stuff worked on. Excuse me. Shoot down that uh, heavy plasma torpedo there. Those things are never any good. And more heavy plasma torpedoes. And now return focus to the warbird. And that takes care of that. Thank you, Captain. You have given us time we need to prepare. We will be free. And with that, we can exit the system. Okay, now we can exit the system. And now, what's my last area? What's my last planet? I need to do for or need to patrol for this deal well it doesn't matter doesn't matter because uh, I'll find I'll just find it and find it later once I record the next video later